Hello and a warm welcome to a stadium that always oozes passion, St. James's Park. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Newcastle United up against West Ham United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. So they starting 11 for Newcastle United. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. Kieran Trippier starts with Matt Target in the fullback positions. Miguel Almiron plays with Alain Saint Maxima out wide. And the idea is he's got to score! And denied by the keeper. Impressive. And he takes it away. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. For Nals. He's got a pair of car keys handed in at reception. A pair of car keys and a wallet. He's got his own reasons. Please collect them. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. Joel Linton. Just the challenge that was required. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Tomasz Socek. Good technique displayed. Can he open them up here? Oh, a superb save. No nonsense clearance. And still looking for space. Said Ben Rama. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Said Ben Rama. But attacking possibilities. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, nothing productive really well as you can see from the stats there's been little between the two teams it's been really tight really cagey let's just hope it opens up and one of these teams is willing to take a few risks and still trying to get the shot off and he did so well to move across and deal with the danger well they haven't created too much lately but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here still not clear And problem solved for now. Well, the first half story has been written. Half time here at St. James's Park. Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, I've been disappointed with him in that. So back underway here into the second half. stop them in their tracks oh great vision can he finish oh fine stop well they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change who can he pick out 
Well, not cleared away completely. Opportunity, and it should have been the first goal of the game. Well, I can't believe that chance has been squandered. That should have been the opener. So far. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Plenty of support here. For Niles. And it might be. And a goal! 1 0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Well, Newcastle United getting the ball moving again. Can they come up for the response now? Substitution for West Ham United. Joe Willock. Off the pitch. Number eight, Pablo Newcastle in a potentially dangerous position. And a chance to level it. Oh, keeper dealt with it. They have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And over comes the corner. Joe Linton. Can he find the net? And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Just 15 minutes remaining. Went in strongly to win the ball. Joe Willock. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. And a yellow card for that, Stewart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Taking care of business defensively here. Opportunity in the wide area. On the attack, as there to be late excitement. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And Newcastle using width to good effect. That's excellent defending following the cross. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Substitution for Newcastle United. Coming off the pitch. Number 28, Joseph Willock. Coming onto the pitch, number 36, Sean Longstaff. And this could finish it off. And slot it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. Substitution for West 
No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. So check. On to Paqueta. And he could really get at the opposition. And there goes the final whistle and the final outcome. A victory for the Magpies. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they...